Hey guys, it's Anna, and today I'm going to be showing you the supplies I use to make my stuff. So, first of all, I have the basic X-Acto knife, but I have the Z-Series blades in it. The Z-Series blades is extremely sharp, so they work a lot better for paintings and just anything, basically. It just makes it twice as easy um, to learn. And then I have these scotch scissors and I don't think there's anything special about them. Just some big old scissors. And then I have this ruler. It's whatever but it's backwards. And I don't really use this one but I have this flex, flexi ruler. I like never use it, but I could if I wanted to. And then I have um, this thing, which I got a long time ago. Uh, I can't remember from where it was from, but I think it was from math class. It came in our books. Yeah, it came with our math textbooks. But um, it's got lots of shapes um, that I can cut like eyeballs out with or just if I need a shape I can easily cut it out with my exacto knife and it also has centimeters on this side and inches on this side and seven inches it's also got this degree thing circle uh, there's some more degree stuff but yeah um, it's pretty useful sometimes and if you're wondering what this is if you haven't watched my um, uh, workspace video then this this is a refrigerator shelf and under here is lots of hot glue and paint it's my mom used to paint and I used to make a lot of stuff out of hot glue so there's lots of stuff under there and I don't know I just found this in the basement so refrigerator shelf and it works really good you can cut on it you can cut on it and it just you don't really leave a mark unless you cut really really deep but it's not like noticeable so it's it's good to make a for flat surface plus it's elevated and it makes it easier so that's what I work on. I'm trying to get um, an exacto board. Once I get some more money, I might get one. I have the money for it right now, but um, I don't like spending my money. But now, this, this is my suitcase that I take to my dad's. It's got some pieces on it. Um, that's because at my dad's, I'm not going to take a refrigerator shelf there. So, I have this plastic suitcase. It used to hold like paint and markers and uh, crayons, but I took the plastic inside out, the, took it out, and now it's just an empty suitcase. So, got lots of stuff in there. It's usually where I just keep most of my stuff. So yeah, that's basically all my supplies. Um, I don't know what else you would consider supplies to use. I use this wonderful lamp. Can't see. Oh no! This wonderful lamp. It's nice and orange. It's got um, it's stuff on it. It's good for holding stuff. I have craft sticks right there. They're not, I don't use them though. I don't like anything helpful. But yeah, so um, I definitely recommend everything I have. Because, especially for beginners, like I've been doing this for a while, but I just, I don't have money because I haven't been able to make money off of this stuff yet. Because I don't want people to send their money through mail and I don't have like a debit card and. But yeah, so um, this is good for basic people. 
just need a ruler and an exacto knife. That's what I started off with. Actually, I just started off with my scissors and my ruler because I had these already. It's probably from like third grade. And it's a duct tape. So basically, that's all you need for beginners. And yeah, so thanks for watching.